Mike Dunn here with the 21 day juice challenge and today is day four and you know what? I don't feel as great today as I did yesterday. The toxins are coming out of my body and whew, I didn't sleep as great last night but I kind of knew it when I did this last time. The same thing happened so um, I kind of expected it. Today and tomorrow will probably be the hardest two days um, for the first week, week and a half. I got some distractions that'll come up near the end of my 21 days that'll also challenge me. So um, here's what we're doing. I got my juice here. Uh, this is what I'm going to drink today. Uh, don't think it looks gross because it's not. This is, uh, this is pure life right here that uh, makes you feel amazing. So today we're going to talk about kale. Uh, kale is incredible and it is just packed with so many amazing things. Uh, vitamin A, vitamin C, vitamin K, calcium. Um, I said it was a superfood. It used to be a garnish on your plate and it's not anymore. It is, um, it's something we should all be incorporating into our diet. It's pretty bland and it doesn't um, taste that amazing, but you chop it up, put it in your salad. Obviously I'm putting it in my juice. It's incredible for your immune system. Um, it just serves so many purposes. It's an anti-inflammatory. So if you have arthritis or you have, um, you know, any of uh, any other problems with your bones or um, tendons that are bothering you or any inflammatory problem, this is great for that. Um, and anti-aging, so um, you can see all the wrinkles on my face from the stress and uh, pressures of life. Uh, this slows that down. Um, and um, that's great, we all need that. It has tons of omega-3 fatty acids. Um, which is something we're always trying to find to get into our body. You know, we use salmon and other things to get it, but just something awesome for our body to have and nourishes it. So um, it combats heart disease, um, which is just something we all need to have. Um, getting a healthy heart is very important. So something to always consider. Um, it's great for lowering cholesterol, which um, when you're on a diet like this is not a big problem, but in today's age, everybody should be considering that. So something very important. And of course it fights cancer, uh, which doesn't ever hurt to have that on your side. So um, it's also great for your eyes. So if you if, if ch challenging eyesight or anything, it's awesome for cataracts and things like that. It has uh, lutein in it, which I guess is great for your eyes. I don't know too much about lutein, but apparently that is an awesome, um, um, I'm not sure if, if that's a, it's a form of protein, I guess. Um, and of course it's a huge detox. Um, it has fiber in it and the fiber um, <clears throat> helps um, your kidneys um, and other organs to process and get these toxins out of your body. Um, and believe it or not, it also strengthen, strengthens your bones. So just endless amounts of um, positive things you can get out of kale. So um, kale, that's the vegetable of the day. Uh, somebody else asked me, how, does it how much does it cost? to juice, it seems expensive. You gotta go to the store every day or every other day, get all these fresh vegetables. And you know what, it's not expensive, it really isn't. I got the receipt here from Sprouts. Uh, this was for my two days worth of juicing. It was $26.18 and that was completely organic. There wasn't anything regular. And the organic food is a little bit more expensive, but so for $26, I'm gonna eat six meals for two days. So break that down, that's $13 a day. So that's what, uh, $4.33 a day, uh, or a meal, excuse me. I mean, that's, that's, uh, that's pretty cheap to eat. Um, that's probably what dinner costs, 13 bucks. So overall, pretty darn cheap. But um, hopefully today will go really good. And even though I don't feel amazing this morning, I think for the next two days, I'm going to get a ton of toxins out of my body. And then uh, I am going to go back to feeling great again um, by this weekend. So um, something that I did expect, and that's just what happens. If you got questions, uh, you can private message me. A lot of people are doing that because they're not comfortable saying it out in the open. Or you can just message it right here um, on Facebook, and we can talk about it. Um, hopefully, I'm continuing to inspire people to do this. And um, here we go. I love everybody, and we'll, uh, we'll see you tomorrow. Have a great day.